so I'm back to the roots here just because things have changed a lot even Voco screen is not the same as it used to be so but yeah things have changed uh, so and with things changing Roblox on Linux has also changed and I'm here to bring you bad news so I constantly 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 get these comments on my video and they're all about doing a new video mostly on this so bad news for you is that Roblox on Linux isn't really a thing anymore as you can see all of the instructions and guide to using Roblox Linux wrapper have disappeared and uh, if I go to the group page, the last post was in August, and basically according to these guys, Roblox Fair doesn't work, Studio kind of works, Roblox for Android can be played in Anbox. So, you can run Roblox for Android if you use an Android emulator, however that's not the kind of thing I enjoy doing. So you'll have to manually figure out how to set up an emulator. On the other hand, I did some research, Roblox Linux wrapper is not a thing anymore. Like we go to the GitHub page and uh, after a few years of attempting to maintain this script, I'll be archiving the project. It is not possible to even use Roblox Studio in Wine anymore. So by the looks of things, the group is outdated as well. And I expect this tutorial video here is dead to... Okay. Yeah, that's from 2015, so rip. So ever since September 2015 the script does not work and it's not been fixed since because it simply just doesn't work. Now a solution I came across, I found this video just looking for like forums and anything about running Roblox on Linux and this guy doesn't explain anything at all. Oh. So he's got a Discord, and so he says to install Wine Free. I wouldn't do that. So I've gone here to the link which I will put in description as this guy's shorten the URL and you get a load of ads and I don't believe in providing ads to people who potentially would click the ads and get a virus so I'm gonna attempt to use this software which looks a little bit sketchy but of course it's just a Windows Forms application that some person slapped together so Okay, so you will have to open terminal so you can use Quake, sorry, Quake, or I'll just use a normal terminal so that it's not weird. Also, if you're curious what distro this is, this is Manjaro Budgie. This is the Budgie desktop, which is why it looks a little bit like Chrome OS. So, CD downloads uh, rbx legacy bundle wine and we'll have to do 
flying configuration stuff. Gecko. I actually hate wine nowadays, so. Here we go. Sure. So this is gonna install it. I have no idea if this even works, so don't. I would recommend not doing this till afterwards, but at the end of the day, I'm gonna make sure I can get it working. So like, if you follow this all the way through, you'll figure out something just like I would. So here we go. Goodness. Okay, well, looks like this actually works, maybe. Well, this is an interesting little thing. You can play old versions of Roblox if you really want. So it looks like this doesn't actually let you play online and I would guess that it's not possible. Uh, one way I think that you could use this is by hosting a server. Yeah, because you've got host, you've got client, yeah so you can host a server. So I suppose let's see if this even works. I'm not expecting it to, but it might. Oh. We have a server.
so I guess you can join the server. I suppose that kind of works. Lags a little bit. Might not like my 144 hertz monitor. But yeah, so apparently you can play the old, old Roblox version. And the crosshair is not responsible for the rocket fires. It isn't, never mind. Damn it, I remember these days. Well, not 2008, but 2009, you know. But, God, these were like when the blocks were fucking sharp edges. And they added proper 3D mode support stuff. Can you even cross? I don't think you can get across. Well, this is an interesting endeavour. Yeah, it's a little bit buggy. And you have to use keyboard controls for stuff like that dialogue. So, can we go up to... Right, okay, we can go up to 2011. Oh god. So I suppose if you really wanted to, you could use this to play with friends, like on a private server. And I mean, by the looks of it, they use RBXL files, so you could uh, probably launch Studio make make a map I guess oh 2011 works for pretty well actually wait 
goodness, this is the old pizza place that like only had this. Wait. Wait, what? God, they did change a lot on this game. I don't even remember it looking like this. But I definitely played it in oh, I definitely played it in 2010. Jeez. But yeah, I suppose you could have a good time on this if you really like Roblox. But it's like, in a way it's not the same as just playing online easy. But if all your friends are on Discord, I guess it's pretty easy. So this is a solution. Not the definitive solution. I guess it'll bring a lot of nostalgia to uh, any older players. Who might have an interest I mean I can't say I do I didn't really want to make a video on this because I just couldn't be bothered but hey ho it's an option I'm just sick of the comments like guys there is no way to play Roblox on Linux at the moment until they release a port and they probably will at some point I can't see why they wouldn't You can record and screenshot full screen. Yeah, so like you could do a fair bit. Um, yeah, I don't really know what I'm doing, I'll be honest with you. I'm really bored. So everything kind of works. But yeah, so that's about it really. Uh, one thing I will say is uh, the fact that you've got the 2009 client, which is probably, th that's the one I'm familiar with. So, uh, so I'm going to just... Find a game that I remember from 09. You know what, why not? Let's go with Happy Home and Roblox here. Then you could be like, ah, oh, I'm gonna join. friends gonna join and then you can like this actually runs really smooth surprisingly enough but for some reason AMD are turning the camera and I don't remember them doing that back then fair as this is a server and studio you could legit just save as so I mean this theoretically could be a way you could like create a place wait why are these bright blue and that's not that's royal blue why is this bright blue Oof. But yeah, 09 is probably my definitive version that I have no clue. But yeah, it works. So if you really, really want to play this game on Linux, you can. 
Not in the way you'd probably like to. Hopefully this is a solution to some of you uh yeah I mean I can't I don't have much to say but yeah so this is a thing thanks for watching uh, and take care